Processed for, we are always looking for ways in which to improve our processes and accuracy. We've reviewed requirements from the networks and from our partners, and as a result, we are refreshing our IoT and M2M ordering process from Monday the 17th of August 2020. This is a short video to show the process for a new IoT or M2M deal. To discuss a deal, contact your channel business manager using your usual process. On agreeing a deal, you will be issued with a deal summary document including all of the relevant information. Please ensure you check all the details on this form. You will have a unique deal reference number and the form will include your tariff details, quantity, contract term, costs and overage rates. If SMS or voice has not been requested or is not available on your tariff, then you will see not applicable in these fields. You can see any details for hardware ordered. And if you are a dealer partner, then any rev share applicable will show in these fields. Contact your channel business manager if any of the details on the deal summary are incorrect. When you're happy with the deal and you wish to progress, please contact your channel business manager or the M2M orders team on m2morders at zest4.com. You will need to quote your unique ZES reference number from your deal summary form. Please note that the deal summary needs to match the deal requirements exactly. Any changes discuss with your channel business manager and they will create a new deal summary accordingly. Your deal is valid for 30 days from the date of issue and if this date has passed, speak to your channel business manager. Once you confirm you wish to progress, we will convert the deal into a connection form containing all the relevant details. The connection form will be populated with the details from the deal summary. Make sure you check all the information carefully. Check that the bearer services are as required. In this example, the SIMs will be provisioned with data, SMS, voice and circuit switch data, but roaming will be disabled. If you require any changes to these services, please contact your channel business manager and be aware that the bearer services are usually built into the tariff, so a change to these may need a brand new quote. Check the overage rates. And for any non-standard overage rates such as roaming, then please contact your channel business manager. Any coloured cells in the form can be amended. Please ensure you add all the required details to prevent a delay to your order. Complete the data alert and cap. These are in megabytes. Enter in a notification email address for the alerts to be sent to. Enter in a delivery address for your SIM or hardware requirements and anything additional can be entered in the comments. You do not need to enter anything in the template code section. If you have a stock of SIMs, you can enter the numbers in here. If you do not hold SIMs, they will be provisioned and sent to the address quoted on the form. Add any usernames you wish us to apply and enter whether the SIM is to have a public IP or not. Note that the number of IPs here must match up to the number of IPs you've requested in the hardware. And a link to the up-to-date terms and conditions can be found here. Once you've completed all the relevant sections, raise an M2M orders support ticket on the customer portal and attach the form or send by email to m2morders at zest4.com. If you are a dealer partner, then the customer must agree the form via email. Please send to your customer to check and ask them to send this directly to the M2M orders team, stating that they wish us to proceed with the order. This must come from an authorised signatory for the customer. For reseller partners, the order form must come from an authorised signatory for the reseller. Your order will then be processed by the M2M orders team. Vodafone orders can take up to 24 hours and all other networks can take up to 48 hours to complete. If you need to query your order at any time, please quote the ZES reference number. This will help us to find your order quickly. Once your order is complete, the M2M orders team will send back the order form with the mobile numbers completed. 
Your confirmation email will also contain any other important information relating to your order. Thank you for watching this video. From Monday the 17th of August 2020, we will no longer accept M2M orders sent by any other method. This is to improve the accuracy and speed of your SIM provision and to give you more complete details regarding your order, including out of bundle and applicable services. Make sure you check out our additional video which shows you how to place an order for an existing tariff or deal. And if you have any queries regarding this or any other M2M or IoT related process, please contact your channel business manager or the Zest4 M2M orders team.